that gate was wide open. So right here, this gate's wide open. Yep, and we got to right about here, and they came running, and we were fighting all through here. Dan Taylor describes the moment two dogs came running out of his neighbor's backyard towards him. It all happened Friday morning when Dan was on his normal walk with Cooper. That's when he jumped on me and I fell to the ground and he slammed my dog again to the ground. As Dan screamed for help, neighbors heard the commotion. School teacher Nancy McLeod Griebel grabbed her bathrobe and ran out her door. Adrenaline does wonders, let me tell you. I just yanked those dogs and I just went, stay, and they did. <laughs> Neighbors tell me the owner of the dogs who attacked is a very responsible dog owner and always has them locked up behind this fence. I've lived here 17 years. This has never happened. Tim is the nicest guy. You know, he so takes care of those dogs. It's okay, Coop. Nobody's going to harm you. I promise. Dan tells me Cooper has quite the road of recovery ahead. He has drainage tubes inside of him and is traumatized by the attack. But Dan's best friend is still by his side. I lost my wife three years ago to cancer, so, and then I had to put two dogs down since, so he's what I got left. Right, buddy? Never happened again, will it? In West Dallas, Christina Palladino, WISN 12 News.